welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Mrs. Freckles. I talk about faith, lifestyle, and fitness, and everything in between. If you are returning, you were a part of the family, welcome back. Y'all know what time it is. It is Meal Prep Monday. On the menu today, we are going to have egg muffins again. We're repeating, but adding in a few more ingredients. And then we also about to have stuffed bell preppers. I love these because they are low in calories and they allow me to um, eat more. As you guys like know, I am on a weight loss journey. I like to have things that allow me to have volume. So I try not to eat as many carbs so that I can have more because as we know, carbs are high in calories. Not keto. I, I do not call myself on a keto diet or any lifestyle like that. However, I do like to watch my carbs so I can have more. So all right, y'all, let's go ahead and get into it. All right, y'all, so first things first, let's go ahead and get our oven set to 375 and allow that to preheat. Then go ahead and grab you a pot and fill it up with some water. We're gonna use this to put our bell peppers in so we can uh, boil them for a little bit so they can be tender. Set that on the stove and allow that to come to a boil. Then let's prep our bell peppers. I go ahead and take all the stickers off and then cut out the center. Add eight medium green bell peppers for this and then cut them in half because that's how we're gonna fill it we don't need to fill you can fill the whole thing but I chose to cut them in half and fill the halves now we're gonna go ahead and wash them make sure we get out all of the inside stuff of the bell peppers and all the seeds make sure they're nice and clean Now we're gonna add the bell peppers to the boiling water. We're gonna allow this to boil for about 15 minutes. Next, we're gonna go ahead and get our meat started. So go ahead and turn on your stove and then put a pot in. I put a little bit of olive oil so that the meat didn't stick because I'm using ground turkey. And I'm gonna go ahead and brown my meat. Break it up because I, I want it to be grounded, not like big pieces. Allow that to cook for about 20 minutes or until it's all brown. Continue to break it up as you need. Next, we're gonna go ahead and season our meat. We're gonna need black pepper, seasoned salt, two packets of taco seasoning, Go ahead and mix that all in. You wanna make sure it's mixed in real good. Once that's mixed in real good, we're gonna go ahead and add some picante salsa. You can actually use the salsa of your choice, but I chose to use picante. I use one cup of that. Then I'm gonna go ahead and add in some sour cream. I used a cup of sour cream as well. Now we're gonna go ahead and mix it all up and it should look like this. It should have like a reddish creamy color to it. it makes it almost look orange. Taste it and make sure it's seasoned to your liking. I'm gonna go ahead and strain the bell peppers. We wanna make sure that it has no water in them and that they're also tender to your liking. Line a baking pan with some foil and then lay out all of the bell peppers. Once you have them all on the tray, you're gonna go ahead and now stuff them. You wanna stuff them with your meat mixture. Fill them up as much as you can. And then we're gonna go ahead and add some cheese. Now we're gonna go ahead and put them in the oven and allow them to cook until the cheese is melted and kind of golden. 
with a little little brown and this is what they should look like at the end all right so now we're getting ready to do our egg muffins first thing first we're gonna go ahead and crack seven eggs you can use brown eggs you can use white eggs it's your choice then we're gonna go ahead and add in three and a half cups of egg whites As y'all know, I'm all into high protein. Go ahead and season it. We're gonna season it with black pepper, seasoning salt, and onion powder. I went ahead and cut up nine turkey sausage links. You can use whatever type of breakfast meat of choice. Honestly, the convenience of doing these egg muffins, you can put in whatever you want. Then also, I'm gonna go ahead and cut up some green onions, which is one of my absolute favorite things inside of eggs, so definitely had to add some of that in there. Now, we're gonna go ahead and put a skillet on the stove because we're gonna saute all of our veggies as well as our meat. Add a little bit of olive oil. Now we're gonna add our sausage and green onions. And then we're also gonna go ahead and add in four cups of spinach. We're gonna allow that to cook down. And then we're gonna go ahead and season it. Season it with some black pepper, seasoned salt, and onion powder. Now we're ready to assemble. First things first, go ahead and spray a non-stick spray in your muffin pan. I use coconut oil. And then we're gonna go ahead and fill it up with our egg mixture. I believe this made 22 muffins. Maybe, this is a 24 pan. I think I only had two open after that. Oh, correction, we had 20. Now we're gonna go ahead and put in our um, filling, which is the sausage, onion, and spinach. You wanna try to make sure that's evenly distributed. And then we're gonna add in two, three-fourths cup of shredded cheese to each one. Now we're ready to go ahead and put these babies in the oven. Gonna allow those to cook for pretty much up to 12 minutes. And now you have the final product. We are meal prep for the week. Okay, y'all, so that concludes the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know down in the comments if you're gonna try any of the recipes. And if you feel somebody can benefit from it, definitely share. If you're interested in the macros, also let me know. Hope you guys come back next week and check out what we have because we keeping it going, we keeping it lit, we going ahead and lose this weight as well as enjoy our food through the process. All right, talk to y'all later. Bye.